So, the World Health Organization come out yesterday and tell us all that uh, processed meat can give you cancer. Have they been watching my Facebook page for the last couple of years? I've been saying this for ages. Not only is it responsible for all kinds of diseases, but what they put into their food, these companies, these multinational companies, it's not a million dollar, not a billion, a trillion dollar business, right? They're pumping it full of poisons and toxins that are scientifically proven to cause obesity. It's already proven that what they put into their food causes obesity. Yet governments around the world, when they've realized that this global epidemic is killing millions upon millions of people worldwide, they try to blame everybody else except for the guys that are actually causing the problem. Now why? Well, let's think about it. If it's a huge, huge financial business, do you think the governments are going to go after these guys? If these guys are creating jobs and taxes and all, never mind that, if these guys are so big, maybe they own the government. I don't know. I'm no Jim Core. There's fellas out there now saying, has Jim Core piled on weight and lost all his hair? No, I'm just telling you to open up your eyes and look at what's going on. These are the same guys that are behind the companies that are telling us, you're far too busy in your life to cook. You have so much going on. Everything is so hectic in such a fast world that you don't have time to cook. Eat our products, ready-made processed food. Now think about it. Are you really that busy? Are you really that busy? Do you sleep one hour a day? Are you like traveling around from here to there from work that you've got no time to cook? That's bollocks. We all know that's bollocks. But these are the guys that are putting these ideas into our head so we buy their products all the time. Now I've done a load of videos where I have proved that it's faster, it's quicker, it's fresher, it's healthier, and it's far cheaper to cook your own food. Just look at my playlist there on fast versus, or fresh food versus processed food. But what I want you to do is I want you to think more and more people, since we've started eating more and more processed food in the last probably two decades, are getting clinically obese, are getting heart failures, are getting diabetes, getting cancer. Now I don't have my scientific information to back me up, but what I have is something that every person has in their family and it's called granny logic. Grannies always know, and they don't have scientific data to back up their statements. They just know. You come in after a soccer match or a rugby match in the lashings of rain, your granny tells you, go up and have a hot shower quick. You won't get a cold. What scientific data have you to back that up, granny? None. I just bloody know. It's too coincidental since this explosion of processed food that we are now seeing more and more diseases, heart failure, Debt, cancer, everything that's coming in. I'm just asking, think about it. It makes sense, doesn't it? And all I want is that on the packet of every single bit of processed food, from ham to pizzas to you name it, that it says, like on cigarettes. And remember the guy who took on the cigarette company and they said, don't touch us, we're too big, we will annihilate you. He won. All I'm asking on processed food is that it states, there are, I was going to call them ingredients, but there is stuff chemicals, toxins, poisons, included in this product that are scientifically proven to cause obesity, to cause diabetes, to cause heart failure, put that on the front of the packet, exactly like your packets of cigarettes. Smoking can kill. It's actually smoking kills because they now know. That's all I'm asking for. Never mind your poxy, inept, boring, useless, lazy politicians who want to be seen to do something coming up with this crap calories on menus. That's going to combat nothing. Go after the source. Go after the main guys. You might have some chance of fixing the damn problem then.